Hello everyone, it's James here with Dragonware, the new YouTube channel that's going to showcase to you guys a lot of different things relating to the uh, digital. Um, right now I'm going to be showing you guys a little bit of a blender tutorial here. Let me give you a little bit of background so you don't think some, I'm just some kind of a uh, flop. I've been using Blender since, uh, well, you know, for a, for, for a pretty long time now. Um, point being, I, I've learned a lot about Blender. I'm using it actually to build a few games that are coming up here in the uh, hopefully near future. Within the next few months, we'll start to see some type of progress with some games that I'm working on. Um, but for right now, I'm going to be showing you guys a quick Blender tutorial because I'm getting really tired of seeing really overly complicated tutorials on Blender subjects. And don't get me wrong, sometimes the complex is required, but not in all cases, especially when you're trying to put a, a game together. You're, you're definitely going to need some type of um, time time on your side here. So give me just a second. I'm going to open up blender it's the newest uh, model blender um, something with a little bit more style is what I'm hoping on um, anyway this is actually really simple uh, for you folks out there that are trying to get into this but you can't import your blender models into unity unity I'm sorry I've been using unity too long uh, UDK the unreal development kit um, you have to triangulate your models first in order to do that you just simply I'm in object mode now you hit tab to go into edit mode hold down the control key if you're using a uh, Windows 7 operating system and uh, you hit control and T and now your object is triangulated you can hit W and uh, start the subdivide as many times as your computer can handle. I have a pretty decent machine, so it can break down a few times here and still be okay. You know, hit tab to go back into object mode. And in a later tutorial, I'll let you guys in on how to export into the uh, Unreal Development Kit here. All right, and that's it for me today. If you'd like, go ahead and subscribe. I'll definitely be uh, showing you guys a few of my game interests here as well. Right now, I'm actually into the S4 League, and I don't know why, but the icon here doesn't show up. You know, it did at first, but now it's gone. I can still play the game and everything. Like, for example, it'll load up, and right there, you'll see the icon. But it's not showing there. Anyway, all right, stick around for my next tutorial. Um, thank you guys for watching. Dragonware is out of the building.